Hey, welcome back to Macro Crazy. Uh, today I'm going to cover uh, another article I found from our friends at Zero Hedge. Um, 15 signs of an economic uh, meltdown, a massive one. Okay, the first few items on the list uh, are all housing related, to no one's surprise. Let's go. Number one, existing home sales down for 10 straight months. Number two, existing home sales are down more than 35% in the last 12 months. Number three, home builder sentiment is down for 12 straight months. Number four, construction costs are up more than 30% since the start of 2022. And okay, last but not least, uh, single family housing permits down for nine straight months. Okay, moving on to more good news. Uh, Empire State Index is now, our last reading was minus 11.2. That was way, way below expectations. Next one is number seven. We saw we just saw the largest decline in retail sales for the year. Okay, number eight, and I apologize for the uh, fire truck or ambulance, whatever's going going behind me in the background. Uh, big layoffs are coming, even for blue chip companies. Uh, Goldman Sachs rumors are they're going to be laying off thousands of workers, like somewhere around four thousand, in the near future. Okay, the next one is the Federal Reserve has basically wiped out all the reported uh, jobs numbers for much of the year that were reported by uh, the Bureau of Labor Statistics, BLS. Um, about a million jobs have been wiped out. They actually had never really existed. So bye-bye. So we look much worse off with that adjustment made. Okay, number 10, uh, job cuts were 417% higher in November of 22 than November of 2021. And that will definitely leave a mark. Okay, next, two thirds of Americans, according to the Wall Street Journal, expect a recession in 2023, which will essentially bring on the recession. Of course, that means that one third of Americans don't know what recession means. <laughs> and for once, economists agree with regular people. 70% of economists also believe a recession is coming uh, in 2023. That means 30%, of course, took uh, economic classes with AOC. And for those who thought inflation is getting under control, I'm looking at you, Goldman Sachs. Uh, there's now $11 lettuce in stores in California. So yeah, inflation is still a problem. And for you vegetable lovers out there, um, yeah, pain, because in the last year, vegetable prices are up more than 80%. And if you're like me and you don't like vegetables, well, it's not relevant. Last but not least, uh, and scariest to me, is that nearly two-thirds of Americans are now living paycheck to paycheck. So they're on the very cu uh, cusp. So what's going to happen when we go into a recession? I don't know. But this could get real ugly uh, real fast. Anyway, uh, not to be a downer, I hope uh, that was at least interesting. Uh, I try to do something different uh, whenever I, I see it out there, bring it to your attention. If you like the content here at Macro Crazy, uh, you know, comment, tell me what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong, uh, what you'd be interested in hearing more about. And of course, uh, uh, like it, comment, subscribe, all the usual jazz. Thanks much. Have a great day.